much as I don't wanna. Hello, hello guys. <laughs> hello guys, it's your boy on kill. Today we're gonna be playing some Payday 2. That's not the intro. Oh, Join no. me, Goober. Be... Oh, he's in. Give me a moment, you dork. <laughs> Whoa. Let's not throw the D word around, alright? Dork. <gasps> David. Wait, I can customize it? Let me equip the, the blue variant so it matches my mask. We ready. Do you believe Logan, Paul, and KSI are gonna fight this weekend? Oh, they're fighting this weekend? Yeah. Uh... Again? Yeah. I guess they rematched each other. Who... I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> that is extremely fair. I'm not gonna pay shit for the fight. I'm just gonna, like, tune in later and it'll be like, Ah, someone won. I'll be like, that they did. And yeah, that'll like, be the end of that. I, like, it's, it's publicity. Like, honestly, I know, I don't know either of them. All I know that, like, wasn't Jake Paul the guy who, like, found a dead body in the forest? No, that was Logan Paul. Jake oh. Paul is his brother, though. Oh, uh, yeah, whatever. That, that's how much I fucking care about them. <laughs> Listen, I only talk about the real brothers. The Mario brothers. Oh, are we going in loud? Oh, no, we're not. I won't be mad if we do go in loud. Did I crash? I think so. We're off to a good start, folks. Oh, fantastic. I I have to move my mouse carefully. Because I know I want to shoot. <laughs> you look beautiful. What we're trying to look for right now is weapon bags. What we're trying to find is the secret recipe of Coca-Cola. That's the real heist. The Coca-Cola heist. <laughs> yeah, Doom Guy, he is a thick bitch. I want him to sit on my face. He's a... <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I want him and Master Chief to headbutt me from different sides. Is this literally just cooking meth? Wow. Welcome to Rats 2. They just got they just got the voice actor for uh Walk to read Bane's old lines. Okay, Walk. And we and then we cooked meth and escaped. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, so here are your cameras. This one and this one. That's it. And Oh. This one. And that one. Yeah. Okay. Let's to go. Fuck. Fuck. I. <sighs> <laughs> Yo, open this up. There should be like med kits in here. Uh, maybe some pills would be in there. Maybe. Yeah, there should be some shotguns and submachine guns somewhere. Maybe a pistol. Where's Bill? <laughs> yeah, rest in peace. <laughs> Spoiler alert for Left 4 Dead 2, Bill is fucking dead. I like, think you had fun, but wake up feeling terrible. And risk doing things that are terrible. I... Did, did you see that? Uh... I thought I did. Um, so, my vision was blurred, nothing was happening, and I was hitting something, and I was thinking, oh, I'm hitting metal, and then all I see is a bulldozer in kissing distance, <laughs> <laughs> and he was just standing there doing nothing. <laughs> he was trying to smooch you. I miss... I miss old cartoons like uh like Courage was a big favorite of mine. I know you and I both enjoy the hell out of Ed, Ed and Eddie. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I loved Courage too. But but man, what about kids next door? 
Yeah, I saw that video. Nice plug. <laughs> oh, that was funny. Oh, it, it like now, now, like after I made that, I, I, I thought to myself, like, I, I thought about it, and it's like, yeah, it was, it was an interesting show. It was very creative. Yeah. It really was. Uh, I, whenever I was sick. You already know, go ahead and uh, put it on any other door. You already know that you're gonna like sit and watch Kids Next Door when you were on your sick day. Oh yeah, I guess you're right. At least that's how it was for me in the Midwest. Yeah. But I you mean... live kind of close to that region, so I'd, it'd be like an hour if anything. What's better, what's good as well is uh, as an adult, you're hearing like all these conspiracy theory, like the, get, the kids from Ed, Ed and Eddie, they're all like fucking in purgatory. Oh yeah. Birds, the cowardly dog. It's like the eyes of a dog. Everything he perceives is evil, except for like you know his owner. I mean, I think there was one where like people were thinking that SpongeBob like represents the seven deadly sins. Yeah, and it makes sense. I mean, I guess it does make sense. I see the reasoning, but the true meaning of SpongeBob is it's a fucking dumb sponge. And I feel like a SpongeBob is not a cartoon that holds up in my eyes anymore. Because as I grow older, like, this is new SpongeBob at least. Old SpongeBob still holds up in my opinion. And some of the jokes still get me. But new SpongeBob, eh. Yeah. It is made for the minds oh, it is made for the minds of kids who cannot sit still for six fucking seconds. Yeah, actually, I had this conversation with somebody earlier before, but it's like, we kind of evolved into this. Um, devolved? Yeah, I guess we could say we devolved. But it's like, we, we've gotten to a point where, like, we can't look at something the more for, a, like, more for a day before we, like, move, move on to something else. Yeah. Like, it's like, I mean, take memes, for example memes. Yeah. <laughs> they got like a week long lifespan, maybe a month at best. I mean, now it's starting to become days. <laughs> one that, one that uh, still holds up though, there's this meme about this guy. His name was Jeffrey Epstein and he didn't kill himself. But that's all I'll say. That's all I'll leave there. <laughs> I can't wait for like, if, if this video ever becomes popular. <laughs> or if my channel ever blows up, for this to be a dated meme in the past, <laughs> and I never have to hear it again. Uh, is there any other cartoons like back on the subject of cartoons? Any um, one any... that people don't talk about enough is the old, not the old old one, but the uh, the older one from like two thousand and three, the TMNT cartoon, the one that had one story. That had story. It was 2D it was animated, 2D not that like weird 3D one we got like years later. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, the one with the kick ass intro. I, they're like, I love being, I love being a turtle. I don't think I've ever seen that one. You're joking. We're watching We're watching that at some point because it's on YouTube, like a few episodes, at least the first four I have seen on YouTube. Alright, uh. Cause that cartoon, that cartoon holds up. Holds up. I, I think... can't say I really watched any cartoons. You haven't? Not a lot. Uh, which one? Like, which ones do you remember watching? You know, like, let me say it, it'd be better than if you name them off and I, I give you a yes or no. Okay, okay. That's how many. Dexter's Laboratory. Did you say Dexter's Laboratory? Yeah. That is like a Nathan cartoon. What was that? Maybe. Dexter's Lab. Oh, it was Nathan. Oh, was oh. <laughs> okay. What about the Powerpuff Girls? Uh, the, the original one, not the reboot. <laughs> Thank you for specifying. Uh, not really. Uh, just kind of a little game on Nintendo 64. That's it. Damn. Seriously? Yeah. Yeah. Toddler me loved it. 
Extra small, David. <laughs> stop, stop fantasizing about me. <laughs> no. I was always a big Soul Calibur and Mortal Kombat fan. I was... My I Mortal Kombat's in my blood. Like when you should get that checked. Are you okay? No, like I think it's like tradition in my family where once you're born, you have to play Mortal Kombat. <laughs> once you're once you die though, they grab you by the throat and rip out your spine. I mean, it's it's the way. It's the way of my family. <laughs> and then beat you with it. Ah, rest in peace, grandfather. <laughs> As far as me goes, I started out with the NES. I played fucking nerd. my own a sh shit ton <laughs> of fucking ridiculous ass games like Total Recall on the TMNT on the NES, well, Silver Surfer, Castle Quest. Mm. That's what I started out with. <laughs> so much fun. Um, if we're talking about first games, um, my very first game was Super Mario Brothers. Like. It was like the, uh, the cart, cart, cartridge, cartridge, cart, sounded, cartridge, sounded out, sounded out, cartridge, no, I don't help him, let him do it, car, charge, car, charge, car, charge, yeah, yeah. anyways, that, that thing, it had, it had duck hunt, and it had it, it was like a two for one, so it had oh, yeah. Duck Hunt and <laughs> Super Mario Brothers in it. It had Duck Hunt. It had it Duck Hunt. Duck <laughs> but yeah, Mortal Kombat Deception, the best three D Mortal Kombat game. Prove me wrong. Oh, I haven't really played any of them except for arcade versions of the other ones. So, as far as I'm concerned, you're right. Yeah. That one was really good. I never fully beat it or unlocked all the characters, but it was really good. Fuck Scorpion's training mode in the story, though. Oh, honestly, I got stuck on fucking Sub-Zero. Sub-Zero was a fucking cakewalk compared to that 12-hit combo bullshit. Hey, listen, you have to- you have to- you have to- you have to feel- you have to experience Scorpion's rage. And you are a cancer. <laughs>